Hey, what's up? It's Simon, and this is the first official training for Limitless. Um, right now, um, what I'm going to be doing is I'm just going to be using – this is an email account that I've got in Browsio, and – this is what I suggest you do as well. I mean, there's no reason why you shouldn't unless you, you just don't have any extra email accounts lying around. I mean, I've got hundreds and hundreds of, of, of just accounts just dormant, just sitting there that I log in and, you know, maybe log in and use every once in a while. Although this particular account, all it's got is a um, is, is this profile. I, I don't I'm pretty sure we haven't logged in or even opened up a, a YouTube account with this yet. It's just a Gmail. Um, so this demo is literally we're just going to demo and I'm going to upload a video and um, uh, it, it we'll see where it ends up. I haven't done any keyword research with it. I just did a little bit of um, Google suggest looking for the most popular towns to do with um, personal injury lawyers and stuff. So we're going to do one of those and then maybe we'll also upload an, an affiliate uh, video as well, maybe in another video, an affiliate um, product. And um, hopefully they'll 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 um, get indexed and get sent straight to the front page of Google. In a lot of cases with the local keywords, it does. That's just the way it works because, you know, there is just that much extra bit of authority, as you guys have already seen in the webinar that we held like two months ago. Um, it just shot straight to page one, index straight to page one, brand new account. So we're going to do the same thing today um, with Limitless, the actual release version that you guys have got sitting on your hard drive. So um, without further ado, let's open up Limitless. So here we go, Limitless YouTube. And yes, very familiar, isn't it? And what I'm going to do is we open up the site over there, just like um, you would do for Browsio. And <clears throat> I've got this profile here. So let me just click new. And we want to open up a project. And then this is what we want here to fill out the information. And then let me just grab this info here from Will Richmond. I'm going to literally copy paste everything over. So that's why I would suggest just doing it like this, guys, because if you've got Browsio, and anyway, that's what Browsio is for. Browsio is for everything else. This is literally just the YouTube uploader. And um, we've got everything separated as you as we do in Browsio, so don't worry about any of that. Same exact tech. Um, just without all of the bells and whistles and stuff, this is just pure um, pure um, Browsio platform. So we're going to add the password and and then the API key, client ID and secret client, we're going to come back, uh, client secret, we're going to come back to. Okay, so just press save and we're going to close that down. And now we've got Limitless open. Let me open Limitless up. And Will Richmond, let's go. What we want to do now, and this is where everything gets... Um, awesome because this is the uh, api based uploader and the biggest um real the biggest nightmare is just basically setting up the api for all of your accounts and this is where we um you know this is where browsio takes over um oops it's gonna open now so now what we want this is the browser we have a built-in browser it's full browser um, we'll have bookmarks over here. These are shared bookmarks, so it's not shared cookies and cache. Everything is totally separated. We save everything just like we do in Browsio, guys. Um, and then we're going to want to go to the Google Developers Console. But before we do, let's just sign in. And what's what should happen is this is what I want to. What should happen is 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 it will recognize. See that 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 image there. Because we're just using the same the same um, IP, and even though there's no cookies on it, the same IP, this should, I mean, it should, it doesn't always, but it, it, it should, no, it's not, okay. But it normally, it would, um, I think maybe because we were on Firefox on that one, and this is, we've come to Chrome, so that's why it hasn't. But within Browsio, when you go from one side to the other, um, you it just recognizes the IP. But maybe this is because it's been so fresh. I don't know. Anyway, so let's just sign in. And we're signed in, no problems. Because, you know, we were just signed in on the other browser there. And let's go to Google Developers Console. Oh, 
Okay, so we're going to do a couple of steps here. First, you need to um, accept or whatever you'll see. There's sometimes a pop-up, sometimes there isn't. Okay, so there's no pop-up this time. What we want is the YouTube data API. And you need to create a project first. So create project here. Create project. And I'm just going to call it Will Rich. You know, and yes, yes, and create. So this is creating the project and giving all the permissions that's needed to use the Google Developer Console. And listen, don't forget, guys, this is YouTube's API. It's it's there. You know, they created this for for us to use. Now, it's you've got to be a, a, a flipping ninja to, to be able to code and integrate like this. So I don't know. I don't know. My, you know, I've got a few theories why it gives an extra boost, maybe because it's just happy not using um, the extra bandwidth needed for uploading normally. I don't know. But anyway, so what I just did there was I created the YouTube um, data API and then I just enabled it after creating the project then I need to go and create credentials. So for some reason, sometimes it does it, it goes around a different route this way. So let's just not confuse anything and let's just use the navigation on this side here. And we wanna to go to the OAuth consent screen and we're gonna do Wills, Wills YouTube and save. And that's going to come up on the pop-up where we do the OAuth because we're, we're going to OAuth into the API, YouTube's API, with this tool. Okay, so we want to create an API key. Okay, created. And we want to create OAuth client ID. Other. Wills ID. Create. I'm just making these up. It could be anything. Totally, totally making it up here. You know, it doesn't matter. I just use it, relate it to the, the word, the name, so that it becomes personal. And I don't know if it makes any difference, but um, we want to now come back here and open up the edit view. And then we want to grab the API here. Copied. API key. And then cancel out of there. And then we want to get the client ID info. And then we want that one. Paste that in there. And then just that now. And we have one more step. Save. And the last step, we right click here and we OAuth API. Because we have our custom browser all set up and separating everything and saving everything. Um, we have nothing else to do. We come in and we've now OAuth. You guys know what these are. They're a pain to set up. Not anymore. And not for you. Okay, so we now allow. And we're good. And that's it. We're now connected to the Google API, the YouTube API. You are the only one that has access to this API. No one else does, as you can see. Well, whoever else you're giving the API key to and you know, sharing that information, they'll also be able to use it. But one of the major, major benefits here is that you're the only one with access to this API. So it's a big deal, right? Because it is actually a, um, you need to spend and invest in getting, um, you know, it coded for you and then updated and all that kind of stuff. It, it's, you know, it's not the simple, it's not the easiest and most simple, um, simple thing. It, it, you've got to be, like I said, a very talented coder, programmer in order to create a uh, an API um, based tool that's going to talk to YouTube. So, you know, I know also they you can add the, um, the thumbnail, um, but I'm not going to do that with this one yet. Oh, I need to go and actually <laughs> sign up to YouTube. I don't think I've even signed up to YouTube here. Um, let's go to YouTube. Okay, so if we go to try and upload and it stops me and creates, then it hasn't. Let's see. Oh, 
So yeah, so you see that we're just creating the account right now, and it's it's not a double verified account. It's just you know a Gmail account. And now we're connected, and that's it. Um, and to switch between the browser and the uploader is just up here, this button here. Okay. And to have the thumbnail, you need to have a verified account. So we're not going to bother with that right now. And we're just going to add a title. Playlists are all here, public, unlisted, private. Yeah, that's if, you know, how you want the video to be uploaded. Playlist, you can create playlists. And if you've got playlists already, it'll import them into here. So we're not, I'm not going to mess with that right now. So um, need a personal injury lawyer. Please click here to, please click here and put your info in the box to have a personal injury lawyer from Chicago get in touch within the next few hours okay whatever um, personal injury lawyer uh, Chicago Chicago personal injury gosh what's wrong with me personally injury lawyer that's enough okay all right so with that's it and um, please you know please subscribe please subscribe to the channel and I'm just gonna go get that link and because we've got the browser it's so easy here right so creative studio view channel because I don't like that link we're just going to go to copy that and then go to goo dot. Don't forget, this is a browser, right? So you can do anything you want in here. You can go to and, and it's all self-contained. Um, obviously, if you've got Browsio, so you don't really need this so much, but it's just simple while you're here just to deal with all the little things, you know? So there we go. We're going to shorten that. That does help a little bit um, with authority, ranking, help, you know, just a little bit there. And anyway, it's just the whole reason is it, it's not a big, long, ugly link to click over here. So there you go. Please subscribe to the channel there. And now we're just going to, if you, you've got translations, you can do that there. Um, all the settings are here, people and blogs. Um, yeah, people and blogs, I think I'll leave that on. Or news and politics. We'll go news and... No, nah, it's not, is it? It's people and blogs actually make more sense there. Um, what else is there? No, people and blogs. All right, we'll leave that as that. And then I'm not going to deal with anything else. And I'm just going to click upload. So that's uploading. And there are a whole bunch of features we've got coming, guys. Like, for example, um, first of all, all of the um, all of this stuff here, this is all spin text enabled, right? So um, while that's uploading, which shouldn't take long, see, it's almost up there, it's almost halfway. So while that's uploading, basically you've got the ability here by clicking this, you can click the file like I did. I just added a file. Now this one over here will add a folder. So if you've got a whole folder with three, four, five, 10, 20 videos, you want to all upload to this channel, then it's just going to go ahead and do that. And then you can then spin this info here, spin this info here, spin this info here. Everything is absolutely 100% spinnable. We're going to be adding APIs for the best spinners um, out there, like I think WordEye and the, uh, what's that other one called? Um, uh, um, not the best spinner, um, spinner, uh, whatever it is, um, one, of, one of those spinners, we're going to be adding a couple, I think two, 
two of them we're going to be adding and um, then we're going to also be adding possibly integrations with uh, content um, systems and adding different tokens and tags so that you can have um, content switched out and changed very easily, um, you know, and have lots of different, um, you know, for local um, for local mass local video uploading with the different tokens, we're going to have that also added in, and a few other other features that we've already got earmarked. With I'm sure loads more to come. So you can also, um, you know, have a whole bunch of these that you're going to be working on at the same time. You don't have to just work on the one. Okay, so that's an, another awesome feature in the way that this system works. Is that um, yes, it's it's going to be a mass uploader, but you really have. Um, pure custom, the ability to just customize everything um, as 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 perfectly as you want, um, or you could just go ahead and just do the mass uploading. It's really entirely up to you how you want to use the uploader. Um, we're just basically giving you all of the options. Okay, so um, that's uploaded. Um, it's still got to render. Let's just double check. Let's go to the browser. Let's see if it's going to if it's got a render. Nope, that seems like it's live. Okay. Looking for the top rated personal injury law. Yeah, I actually got. Uh, oh, that's someone else that wants it. I actually got two guys on Fiverr to go out and make this, and one guy who I'm personally working with, and may give access to him. Of, um, to a few other people once we get a whole thing um, set up with him. He's really good. Um, but I wanted to do this video ASAP, so I actually did the voiceover on this. Um, you know, short video. So, top rated personal injury lawyer, Chicago. Let's see if we're anywhere to be found. Um, you know what, I'm just gonna open up browser here because it's easier. I think we'll just go like that. It takes you to Google. Top rated personal injury lawyers in Chicago. Let's see if it comes up here. Oh, I should have pressed. Oh, there we go. You see, so we're number one. Look, indexed and in already. Okay, so indexed and in already number one. As you can see, we've come straight over everyone. Straight over everyone. Okay, there's no messing around here. That was a brand new account. Um, straight over everyone. We've got um, these guys since 2013. Um, sorry guys, one second. I'm just gonna pause. All right, sorry. That's a, that's everyone messaging me for access to this. <laughs> so don't worry, you're gonna get access to it. So you can see, two minutes ago, William Richmond. You saw it here. You saw it as well two months ago on that video where we went straight to the first page of Google. But obviously, we're talking about lawyers in Chicago here, so I wasn't sure if it was gonna go anywhere really. Um, but it did. And you just need a little bit of, uh, you know, some, some embeds um, and a couple of um, uh, backlinks to that. And, and I'm sure it's going to be pretty easy to push that to pay to the actual search results. I'm just searching through here to see if it's anywhere else to be found. Um, but no. OK, but there you have it. The whole point is it's there. OK, it's it's indexed and it's gone to the top the absolute top of the results for personal injury lawyers in Chicago, top rated personal injury lawyers, Chicago. Okay. Very, very cool. I'm actually impressed with that one. I, I didn't know it was going to go straight to the top. Obviously I had no idea where it was going to go, um, but I love it when things like this happen live and you can see these people here have had their accounts deleted. I think a lot of people spamming and trying to mess around here. So, I don't know when you come up with like a you know a nice clean API based unique upload you fresh keys set up only by you used used only by you you know Google rewards you as you can see they reward you no need to even index nothing straight to the top okay so guys um, that's how to use it let me go back to limitless that's how to use it and now um, you could just basically go and use Browsio and CrowdSearch and you could use if you've got Limitless and you don't have Browsio, you can add like as many profiles as you want here and you can go do and get your views up a little bit and go and engage a little bit with other places, share the video, social media, um, you know, Facebook share is perfect for this. They, that's awesome for helping it getting, getting ranked in, in Google itself. So right now, as you can see, I did nothing except upload it and there it is, top of Google. All right, guys. Peace, and um, let me know if there is 
anything. I want to hear your feedback. That's the whole reason of only letting it out to a few guys right now who I know are going to take action and take advantage of this tool. All right, peace. Talk to you soon. Thank mm -hmm. you.